Hello and welcome my Ongolicious lovelies. This is the fifth edition of the Onga Cook Hearts competition, a culinary experience that has been specially designed to bring out the raw talent in our home economic students all over Ghana. We have scoured through the length and breadth of Ghana. We went to Hamele, we went to Boko, from Keta to Axim, and we are bringing you the best of the best schools to compete, to win a chance, to win a whooping 20,000 Ghana cities. And it's going to be an amazing show. Let's give ourselves a big round of applause. <laughs> Today we are having an outdoor program, so formerly we've been doing indoors and today we are being hosted at the Ghana Education Service Headquarters and we are bringing you a scintillating show today. Let's give ourselves a big round of applause. <laughs> So we have to begin our competition and we have five schools competing for a chance to win a spot in the national stage of the competition. And we have all the way from the Bonner region, Notre Dame Girls Senior High School. From the Northern region, we have Tamale Senior High School. From the Volta region, we have Keta Senior High School. <laughs> From the Upper West region, we have Jamaat Islamic Girls Senior High School. <laughs> and last but definitely not the least, Wesley Girls Senior High School from Keta. <laughs> Are you guys ready? Yes. So which school do you think is going to take their, po their spot? Yeah. I can hear Keta. I can hear... Is it Tamasco? Is it Keta? <laughs> Remember, there is only one spot. So Madam Lily, take us away. Sit down. Okay. Okay, Angie, thank you very much. And my first question goes to... Wesley Girls Senior High School, all the way from Cape Coast. Contestant, listen attentively. I will read the question twice. Repeat the option twice. I won't repeat it again. So listen and listen attentively. Are you ready, contestants? Yes. So, Wesley Girls, you pick the first question in round one. Which of the following utensils can best be improvised for direct steaming. Which of the following utensils can best be improvised for direct steaming? A, steam. B, plate. C, colander. D, casserole. I repeat the options again. A, C, B, plate. C, colander. D, casserole. Speaking to the microphone. C. Colander. Colander is the right answer. The Colander. <laughs> Jamiet Girls Senior High School. Which of the following fuel is the cleanest? Which of the following fuel is the cleanest? A. Charcoal. B. Electricity. C. Gas. D. Kerosene. B. Electricity. Electricity is the right answer. Keta Senior High School. A cut of meat, which is suitable for grilling, is. A cut of meat, which is suitable for grilling, is. A. Shin. B. Neck. C. Cellion. D. Flank. The options again. A. Shin. B. Neck. C. Cellion. And D. The flank. C. Cellion. The Cellion is the right answer. <laughs> Tamale Senior High School. Listen attentively. In food preservation, the process of bottling includes... In food preservation, 
The process of bottling includes A. Sterilization, exclusion of air and addition of edible substance. B. Exclusion of air, dehydration and addition of edible substance. C. Exclusion of air only. D. Pickling and dehydration. I take the options again. A. Sterilization, exclusion of air and addition of edible substance. B. Exclusion of air, dehydration and addition of edible substance. C. Exclusion of air only. And D. Pickling and dehydration. Madam, please, it's A. Sterilization, exclusion of air and addition of edible Exactly the answer. Notre Dame Girls Senior High School. In sponge mistress, eggs are used as. In sponge mistress, eggs are used as. A. Binding agent. B. Raising agent. C. Thickening agent. And D. Enriching agent. I take the options again. A. Binding agent. B. Raising agent. C, thickening agent, and D, enriching agent. B, raising agent. Raising agent is the right. This brings us to the end of round one. <laughs> At the end of round one, Wesley Girls Senior High School had 22 points. Jamed Islamic Girls Senior High School had 16 points. <laughs> Keta Senior High Technical School had 14 points. <laughs> Tamale Senior High School had 20 points. <laughs> and Notre Dame Girls Senior High School had 18 points. <laughs> Contestants, are you ready for round two? And is that true or false question? Remember, it's not transferable. And if you got the answer right, you got three points. My first question goes to Wesley Girls Senior High School. Listen attentively. You have 30 seconds to answer the question. For proper and effective utilization of protein in the body, serve carbohydrate foods with protein foods. Mm. For proper and effective utilization of protein in the body, serve carbohydrate foods with protein foods. True or false? True. true. It is very true. It's very true. Jamiat Girls Senior High School. There are four main types of carbohydrates. There are four main types of carbohydrates. True or false? True. My darling, it is false. We have the saccharides, which are the sugars. We have the polysaccharides, which are the starches. And we have the cellulose, which are the fibers. So we have three, not four. We are learning. Keta Senior High Technical School. Glucose is found in fruits and honey. Glucose is found in fruits and honey. True or false? True. It is very true. It is true. Tamale Senior High School. Sucrose is found in beetroots and sugarcane. Sucrose is found in beetroots or the beets and sugarcane. True or false? It's true. It is true. It is true. Notre Dame Girls Senior High School. Maltose is produced naturally 
during germination of vegetables. Maltose is produced naturally during germination of vegetables. True or false? False. It is false. It is false. And what's the right answer? During what uh, uh, process? The production of what? It's the malt sugar. Yes, so we get it from what? Germination of what? Cereals. Yes, cereals and grains. Right, it's not vegetables. At the end of round two, Wesley Girls Senior High School had 12 points. <laughs> Jamiel Islamic Girls Senior High School had 9 points. <laughs> Keta Senior High Technical School had 15 points. Tamale Senior High School had nine points. And Notre Dame Girls Senior High School, all the way from Sunyani, had 15 points. <laughs> Contestants, we move straight to round three. And round three is the problem of the day. Contestants, you have the problem of the day in front of you, but the audience needs to know what you are doing. My audience and my contestants, you listen as I read. Proteins. Proteins are important in our diet. Without protein, the human body cannot function well. Proteins are important in our diet. Without proteins, the human body cannot function well. Contestants, explain to the audience the following about proteins. One, in a tabular form, list three differences between complete and incomplete proteins. Two, state and explain the types of amino acids and give three examples each. And three, explain complementary and supplementary value of protein. I pick the question again. Proteins are important in our diets. Without proteins, the body cannot function well. Explain to the audience the following about proteins. One, in a table form or in a tabular form, list three differences between the complete and incomplete proteins. Two, state and explain the types of the amino acids and give three examples each. And three, explain complementary and supplementary value of protein. Contestants, in two, one, you have ten minutes. Your time starts now.
eight. Audience, let's go. Seven, six, five, four, three, one. Drop your pants. Let's give them a big round of applause. So I am very certain that Antelope give us the results when you have handed over your script to her. So please, from Wesley Girls Senior High School, please bring your scripts to Aunt Lily. Let's give them a big round of applause, please. <laughs> Jamiet. Oh, we can keep clapping for these ladies. I believe they've done amazingly well. Yeah, we'll wait to see what they've done for us. Followed by Keta. Please bring your scripts to Aunt Lily. Keta, Tomasco, and Notre Dame. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Remember that our program is proudly brought to you by Ghana Education Service with collaboration from PMC Media and sponsored by Onga. Mama's helping hand in Lele'i. My name is Angela Abinaje and we are moving straight to the hot kitchen. Now we've brought you the mystery basket. We've brought you shop and cook. Today, Zone C's competition is all about indigenous cuisine. And I am, I, I am amazed at the question that they will be doing today. The question is simple. The Director General of Education will be having a meeting with all senior high school heads and other directors. On the 5th May 2023, to discuss the importance of GES Onga Cook Art Competition as a way of promoting our indigenous Ghanaian foods. So, that is the preamble. So the Director General he has invited all senior high school heads and some directors to discuss the all importance of this competition. So what the contestants are supposed to do is to look at our indigenous foods. And the question is, they are going to do that by preparing a two-course meal for the guest of our daddy, the Director General of Education. And in addition to that, they prepare a nourishing drink because our daddy invited the heads and the directors they have to also plate a cover so it's in three one they are preparing a two course meal and two a nourishing drink and three they plate a cover so that is that's for the party Ladies and gentlemen, let's give them a big round of applause. <laughs> so, well, it has been a hot kitchen here at the Ghana Education Service. And I, I, I can't wait, actually. I can't wait to see what they made of the question that the judges gave to them. So, um, before that, I think the very third round of the first competition still needs to be called. 
So we'll go straight to Auntie Lily Vestanyako. But before that, remember that our show is proudly brought to you by Ghana Education Service in collaboration with PMC Media and sponsored by Onga, Mama's Helping Hand in Lele. So Auntie Lily, I think the very third round, we need to hear the, um, the results yeah. and then we can proceed from there. All right. <laughs> Did you use shea butter? Yes, please. We use the shea butter to cream it. Instead of the margarine yes, and butter. Please. I think this is it's amazing. Mm. Thank it's you. amazing. <laughs> it's so much amazing. All right. Okay. So please you with sliced apple and purple with uh, coconut, which is prepared from caramel sugar and grated coconut. Then, and for the drink, we have Tiger Velt drink, a mixture of uh, velvet tamarind, a mixture of velvet tamarind, baobab fruit, and Tiger nuts. Yeah. So next time, learn to display more ingredients. The key ingredients that you use, learn to display them more. Okay. okay. So for me, mm. the only thing I enjoy right now is this one. I don't know what what use this is. Thai coconut. Yes, this is delicious. But with your plating, it's just double plating. You are having a plate sitting in another. Which uh, is not advisable. You have the leaf, you could have just served in the leaf or in the pot in the earthen way and avoid all the other plating. Oh, okay, they are there. We'll move straight to the results. Contestants, you've done very well. You are all winners. It's not easy to be in the hot kitchen, neither is it easy to answer questions within a minute. You've done very well. But we need just one school to represent your zone for the nationals. So straight away, I move to the results. And with 67... I'll take it again. <laughs> you were doing some ads, so I was confused. <laughs> okay, all right. So I'll move straight to the results. With 47.5%, the fifth position goes to Keta Senior High Technical School. Please, you move forward. You move forward and you pick your prizes. Please, we can do better. They've done well. It's not easy. It's not easy. Yeah. Let's give it up for them. Okay. Please take your seat. Thank you very much. With 48.5, 48.5, the fourth position goes to Jamel Sini Islamic Girls. <laughs> Jamel Islamic Girls, you've done well. You've done very, very well. So, with 51%, 51%, the 3rd position goes to Tamale Senior High School. Tamale. 
Big round of applause, people. Is it not true, damn girls? Is it our rainy champions, Wesley girls? Okay, so um, Wesley girls join me. Not three jam, join me. Obedium! It is less than two. So with five, six point two. If I want to even wrap up, it will be five, six point five or so. Yes. So with five, six point two, the second position goes to Wesley Girls! <laughs> Wesley Girls! I think you have to tell us the mark of Notre yes, Dame. Yes, I will tell you the mark. Yes. I will tell you the mark. So, so, as I said, it's less than two. Wait, 58. 58. Percent. So if you read, you read it's 1.8, right? 58 percent. The first position goes to all the way to Sunyani. Not, Not right down. down.